Hey YouTube, Wizardwig101 here. I want to show you a little bit more, some more work stuff. I think you're going to find this really cool. So check this out. Now, I know that y'all have seen those before. The uh, Kai Pros, right there. Make sure it's all in focus. But now what we have are multi-view monitors. This is our ME or Mix Effects 1. Sliding over here is ME Mix Effects 2. Now, what ME 2 is controlling is the center screen, way up there. All right. What ME 2 is controlling are the two side screens, panning over, right there. You can see that, okay? Let me just go ahead and uh, show you this. Now what this is, is, is I pick an input, you see playback Mac, Mac Mini, camera 1, camera 2, so on and so forth. We've got uh, ME1, which is preview, which is the camera. And what's up there now, is you see, is uh, playback Mac. Sliding on over here to ME2. We've got uh, playback uh, Mac in the hole, and currently on the screen is the Mac Mini. That's the uh, image uh, ISC uh, 2014, 2014. What's controlling this? That right there. That's a Mac Mini. Got the software loaded on. We have another Mac Mini there that is uh, actually putting out some of the graphics. Then we have another Mac right here, which is uh, also putting out some of the graphics. Sliding on down here, just like uh, before, we got a couple more of those Kai Pros recording. And, well, that's just a MacBook that's open. And somebody could get on Facebook and mess with somebody's mind if there was Facebook on there. And then, of course, one camera control right there. So this is our video world right here. Pretty cool. Kind of try and back up here so you can see both the uh, multi-view monitors simultaneously. That's pretty cool. So anyways, this is the back of house in uh, Video World right here. Oh, I didn't show you the uh, control screen. Let me go over there and show you that. This is the Atom software put out by Blackmagic. This is a Blackmagic uh, design switcher and right there I can control both the ME2 and ME1 with that switcher via the software I don't even need uh, the uh, remote control so pretty cool let me go out in the front of house and kind of uh, show you what it looks like out there. I'll be right back. So anyways, here is what the front of house view looks like. Um, this is for a company called HD3. We are the AV providers. We provided all of the audio visual for this. Um, the set, we designed the set, the way that looks. We've got uh, a camera with long lens right there. This right here is a uh, Behringer X32 sound console. This is a pure digital console. All of the audio people that I've talked to say that it is a real, real nice console. We are running down to the back of house, to the... Uh, processors and everything else uh, via EtherCon, which is like a, a long, very sturdy, very high-end uh, Cat5 cable. Um, and this right here is the rest of the tech deck. I won't show you lighting control because it's just a basic lighting console. So anyways, this is what that looks like. Let me show you what the screens look like up here. And 
let me show you what some screens look like, what the screens look like, with the full house effect. Sorry for the shakiness, this is, sorry for the shakiness, this is my iPad that I'm shooting this with. So, we provided all of this, HD3 AV, provided uh, the set, we designed it, we built it, we, uh, we provided all the audio visual for this uh, group, and uh, we are pretty excited about this. So, I'm going to sign off for now. Thank you very much for watching. Thanks for listening. Please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Y'all stay safe and shoot straight.